Welcome to our first lesson on our smartphone online course. Um, today, we're going to talk a little bit about um, downloading apps, um, how we get applications, which are apps are like Facebook and Twitter and Gmail, WhatsApp. Those are all called apps. So um, the app that I want to talk about today is Zoom. And why do I want to talk about Zoom? Because of COVID-19, we're all at home isolated and we would like to communicate with our friends and family and an easy way to uh, communicate is through zoom why uh, specifically zoom because zoom lets you talk to more than four people at a time um, on a video call that means that if i have 10 family members um, that want to um, have a meeting or or um, basically have a virtual meeting then they can all see each other and talk and have a conversation um, without much difficulty. So, first thing we're gonna wanna do is download the app, okay? I don't have Zoom on my phone. I've never heard of Zoom yet, um, so app apparently I'm not gonna have it on my phone. So I'm gonna wanna download it. So the first thing you're gonna wanna do is look for the Play Store, okay? The Play Store is where I get the applications on, okay? It's, it's basically the Google um, App Store. Okay, so you're going to look for this symbol on your phone. It might be in a different place on your phone. Um, I put it on my home screen, but you should look through your whole phone. Maybe it's uh, where all of your apps are. Um, uh, make sure you find it because it's a very important app. So you're going to want to tap it once, okay? A slight tap, just like a click on the mouse, okay? And... If you have uh, something like this, you can just say not now. Always look for the exit um, when you have pop-up uh, um, um, symbols. So, now, may, as you can see, there's a square on the top, okay? This square is my search square, okay? You're going to want to press in the middle where it says search, okay? One tap. Now, the keyboard should come up, and you're going to want to type Z. O O M. Okay. If you see this symbol right here, go ahead and press on it. Um, if you don't, and you just see um, maybe Zoom or or something like that, press on one of the options. If you see an icon with the blue a blue icon with a, a video tape in it, video camera in it, then press on that. Okay. So we're gonna press on Zoom and make sure that you are you see this symbol. Okay not anything else and it says zoom cloud okay you can go ahead and tap on it and then you're going to see the install button just tap on the install and wait for it to install i'm going to skip the video um, so that it finishes installing it might take you guys a couple minutes okay and the way that you'll know that zoom finished downloading is that you'll have an option to open the app you can open the app because it's downloaded and installed on your phone so Go ahead and open the app, tap on open, one slight tap, just like a click of the mouse, and Zoom should open. Now, there's a couple options to sign in, okay? You can either sign up, which is the long uh, way of signing in, or you can do, you can press on sign in on the bottom right here, okay? Just tap on sign in, and then you're going to want to press on Google, okay? This is basically signing in with your Google account. Instead of needing to make another password and another username, all you need to do is just tap on Google. And, and um, I'm warning you, the, the, the page is going to get a little fuzzy because I don't want um, everyone to see my information. But basically what you're going to see on this page is a bunch of, um, not a bunch of, maybe one or two of your Google accounts. Choose the one that you want to use. Um, it should be your primary account. Tap on the email address, just one slight tap, and Zoom should sign in through Google, okay? Um, another way of signing in, if you do, if this stuff is to press on sign up, okay? If that doesn't work for you, you can press on sign up, and then Zoom will ask for your birthday, it will ask for your first name and your last name, and your email address. You have to have a valid email address that you can check. Once you put in your email address, it's going to send you a verification email where you're going to have to open the email and verify that this email is yours, okay? Those of you who have done things like this before, 
um, you should be familiar with it. Those of you that haven't, um, you can try. If you're if you're not successful, I think you should have a family member just help you with opening the email and verifying your account. So that's it for today, folks. Um, touch you how we 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 download the app, installed it, and we sign in um, with Google. You can also try to sign in with Facebook. Um, but once you sign in with Google, um, you tap on your email address and it should launch Zoom. If it does not launch Zoom, you can press on launch Zoom right here in blue. Um, for general knowledge, anytime you see a blue writing and not black writing, it's, it's, uh, it's, it would, it's usually a link that is like a button. You can press on it to open um, Zoom, or to open it in, in a website or an article. Um, we're going to learn more about that in the next couple, couple of weeks. So I just press on Zoom and it opens the application. Next lesson, we're going to learn how to, how to um, turn on the microphone and the video and all the things that you need to know to join a Zoom chat. Goodbye for now and we'll see you tomorrow.